this, but this is pretty damning. Because at the end of the day, whoever wrote this stuff isn't Jake's team. I got fat bags of skunk, I got white apple bones, and I'm about to go get lifted. Yes, I'm about to go get lifted. I got myself a 40, I got myself a shorty, and I'm about to go and stick it. Yes, I'm about to go and stick it. Put in the comment section who said it, man. Where the hip hop heads at, mate? Where the hip hop heads at, mate? Guess who's bedecked? Still smell all my clothes. I know y'all been waiting for this video. Oh, yesterday, 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 yesterday. So, Jake Paul dropped, I'm, I'm gonna give you a quick little synopsis. Jake Paul drops fresh out of London. This is KSI in the beginning. I react to that, I say, oh snap. <clears throat> Looking like he got some KSI smoke on the records. I'm trying to see, you know what I mean? The battle happened, whatever. KSI drops a response video. Reacting to the video. That's what we reacting to today. Jake Paul hit me up yesterday. I posted it, you know, thought it was cool that he reached out. Da, 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 this, down the third. Made a video about it, everything. I got bombarded. Bombarded with messages like, yo, Jake didn't write this song, screw. And I'm like, wait, 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 what? And I was hearing it all throughout the day. I was like, wait, wait, wait. Do y'all got proof? A lot of y'all saying designer wrote it. Bro. Yeah, and, I, and, I, and Jake hit me up, you know, blah, 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 blah. He's hitting up other reactors the same way. I'm not even mad at that because reaching out in any way, if, if people react to my stuff and I say thank you the same way I say thank you to another person, I'm still thankful, you know what I mean? But I'm here about the song. Jake, did you write the song? Did designer write the song? Did Mr. Band write the song? Because you already know I love design. Niggas know I love designer. And come on, let's get into a KSI. Is fighting Nate Robinson on an exhibition boxing card. Mike Tyson is fighting Roy Jones Crazy. as the headliner. Wow, it's all a bit mad, fam. 2020 is mad, you know. <laughs> Man has downgraded for me to Nate Robinson. <laughs> I'm just thinking with this whole Jake Paul, Nate Robinson thing. If Jake loses, this just deads our fight. <laughs> it just deads it. Like it kills the hype and everything. I don't, I, I don't know why he's decided to do this, but anyway. If that is a true statement. You know, I was waiting for KSI's response, huh? It's a bloody good statement. You know what I mean? I was waiting for the response. I was kind of hoping it was going to be in song form, but hey, it's cool too. If he wins, then yeah, this is going to hype up our fight even more. All right, so for those of you wondering, or I guess didn't know, Nate Robinson is a former NBA player. He's five foot nine. Don't let the five foot nine height thing change your opinion on him. Mine can dunk. <laughs> this is him dunking over That's Shaq. That's it. It's a Shaq solid seven wall. Seven foot one. This nigga like this, and Nate. Nate dunks over him. Yeah, don't sleep on, don't sleep on Nate Robinson ever. Look at this. Bunnies! <laughs> That's mad. Mad five foot nine. He didn't quite dunk over him, but he did put his, he did posterize him though. And I can do a madness. But when it comes to boxing, I just don't see it. Like I try looking for fights or anything. Bro, there's nothing. There's no fights. I don't think he's ever fought anyone. Like I've searched for sparring and I, I can't find any sparring. So I found some pad work that he's got. I guess we'll check him out. Okay. Yeah, I saw this clip too. It looks like he's got good speed. He's athletic though. That's what I said. That's what I was saying. With pads, anyone could look good on pads, man. The best. Why'd you look at the pads then? I thought you. <laughs> Why'd you watch it? <laughs> way to see how good of a fighter someone is is through an actual fight <laughs> a bag or pads they don't hit back right? I'm, I'm looking at this man and don't 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 get it twisted man <laughs> Nate Robinson I feel a little bit don't get it twisted bruh don't get it twisted bruh don't get it twisted bruh I said I think where, where the, his athleticism is gonna click in to a lot of that stuff you guys gotta understand that Nate Robbins has been doing athletics longer than y'all have been boxing, period. So, though he's an amateur in boxing, look at this nigga. You know what I mean? <laughs> I'm not impressed. He's not... Like, he just looks stiff, fam. He's not rotating the body. It's just... Oh, man. 
Jay's gonna fucking win this. Jay's gonna fucking win this, and this is gonna boost his ego even more. For fuck's sake, man, this is such a dog. I'm gas to this though. Tyson versus Jones. Like, it's gonna be sick to see uh, Tyson fight again. Same with Jones. Uh, obviously, I I wish they both didn't fight. <laughs> I was about to say, am I the only person? They don't want them to fight like it's great that it's a big moment, but God, these guys are too old and too powerful still. That's what I'm saying. It's not that they're just old. Don't, don't get it twisted. Mike Tyson still has Mike Tyson strength. It might not be 25-year-old Mike Tyson strength, but it's definitely the strength where you don't want to hit in, like an elderly man in his head with the power. You know what I mean? Like Same thing with Jones. It's just remain as legends i mean they still will be legends there's something about them being there but it's cool that they're coming I mean, back i don't know boxing's a young man's sport so i know uh, these guys don't need to be fine but i guess to them they feel like they need to so yeah, it is what it is I agree with uh, that. i'm gonna watch it anyway <laughs> i'm gonna watch it anyway but uh yeah let's let me do the main thing that i was gonna do anyway for this video and that is react to fresh out of london yeah that's what i wanted to see Try oh, <laughs> So Jake, when you fighting KSI? Sure, I don't know. Whenever he stops playing FIFA. I was hearing another thing playing in the background. That's weird. I up the Ruger. It's it's just give him the smoke then. I'm here for it. Stops playing FIFA. What does that even fucking mean? I don't even play FIFA. <laughs> what do you want about? Oh my god. Okay, whatever. I mean, I guess I play clubs. <laughs> I play clubs with the boys. So what? I have to stop playing clubs with the boys? <laughs> Get out of here, man. This guy's an idiot. Patriots DM. Ew. Girl, same. But I heard it was like this. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. This part mad cringy. I definitely said, I hope. I said in my reaction, I said, I hope Jake didn't write that. I hope like they just ad lib that because that will be cringe, but it'll be less cringe because I see what they're trying to do. They're just trying to pander to Jake and make him feel better. But if a, if a dude wrote that and said, this is what you're supposed to say, that's a L. That's weird. Okay, okay. Got a funny story here. The girl that was acting in this little scene uh, actually DM'd me. <laughs> Let me show you the DM real quick. Dude, that was the girl with the British accent in Jake Paul's music video roasting you. And I just wanted to say, I was just delivering my lines. I don't even know if you're going to see this, but I was just doing the job, and I hope you didn't take offense. All love to both you and Jake. That's super corny. That's wild corny. And then it does confirm that somebody else wrote the lines. Oh no! Ah, but don't do that. Like it's up to KSI how you rash stuff. That was me. I would. That's corny. That's <laughs> you still said it. Like, I know mean, it's just funny, isn't it? <laughs> so pretty much after that, I mean, this whole intro just it, it's just dead now. <laughs> yeah, facts. It's, it's I mean, I, I wish. Uh, yeah, anyway, I wish we, you would have said that in the bar. Move. And, I, and it's so funny. Like they're like, oh, I heard my penis like this. <laughs> it's just not though. <laughs> It's just not. <laughs> I'm gonna take your word for that, pimp. This beat hard. This beat hard, my nigga. Say this beat ain't hard. I'm trying to figure out who wrote it though. That's this song has got nothing to do with London. It could be the hotel in LA though. He could be talking about the hotel. J J Joey! I don't need new friends. I don't like fake friends. Only here to make ends. Call when they check in. I don't like partial. Need a whole back end. Fresh out of London, she still got an axe. The crew like a palace. I took her to bestest. If he wanna feature, then we gotta tax him. I got me a babbage to cover my max. And the comments is shook up. They throwing a tantrum. Yeah. All right. Yeah, remember when I said in my reaction, if you haven't seen my reaction to this, go back and watch it. My number one thing is like, man, this just doesn't sound like Jake Paul. Remember, I was like, it just feels weird coming off of him. And people are saying he didn't write it, so. It's flooded. No competition can I feel lied to, Jake. I need to know if you wrote it or not. Why is this alright? Why is this alright? Why does this actually sound alright? There's something up. There's something up. Flow wise, like the lyrics, everything. Bro, I'm comparing this to his previous music. <laughs> That's literally what I said. Change. It's a huge change. What? That's what I said. I'm lit. They know it. They wanna hate on the music, but I'm making hits. These hundreds. I throw I 
money like 80 and show this some minimum shit. I leave the house that I'm wearing some shit you can't get, and I swear this shit crawling like up abs all week. I'm a vet, quick trip for the bag, fell asleep on a jet on a different time. This is all nah, yeah, this shit, this shit hard. I, this shit hard. That's why I, I just need to know who wrote it, man. Fact. This nigga ain't write this. <laughs> no. No, no, no. All right, we got. We need no bring way. proof out. There is no way. There is no way. There is no way this motherfucker is written this. There's no way. No, 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 no. So that nigga got super Nigerian. Oh, you niggas don't even. When he went like this. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. <laughs> that nigga got super Nigerian. Because this is, this is, this is just levels above what Jake can do. That's what I was saying. That's why I was. That's why I was so impressed and so happy about the Dukes. I'm like, man, I'm just glad that YouTubers are making good music and everybody seems to be getting off that cringe shit. Yo, what is this? This actually just sounds all right. Yeah. This is the Tory Lanez, and this is a banger. <laughs> like, what the fuck? If Tory Lanez literally rapped the same lyrics, this is a banger. Oh, we don't get a mom. I definitely think Tori would not have made this song. Tori would have done it different. He would have made it better. This is a good, don't get it twisted, guys. This is a good song for Jake Paul. And like, this is definitely a designer type song, but come on now. Tori, Tori a little, he bugging right now with the Megan thing. I don't know how I feel. I don't even know what's going on. Like, shout out to Megan. I hope you're okay. Um, you beautiful. Listen, I don't, I would have been there. Would have been issues. Anyway, so um, yeah, I don't know. That was a weird tangent. But. Don't you dare leave a hickey on my neck, cause the color to massage my back. I'm stressed. I'm stars in the roof get the bitch undressed with an ass like that. I forget my ex. Racks like this, man. The God I'm blessed. I've been on top. I should beat my chest. Tell you that she loyal. We gonna put it to the test. What? She definitely doesn't sound like that's why I was like it's, as I'm hearing this. Like God, that's just so not Jake Paul. And that's why I was like maybe I missed the struggle part. Because this sound, that's what I'm, man, y'all don't be getting it, bro. These are bars that came from someone who has struggled before. Whoever wrote this has had some struggle. And that's why I was like, I can, I can relate to the bars. I just can't relate to who's saying it. It's weird. Oh, my God. This is nuts. <laughs> There's no way. No, 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 no. I'm not accepting it. I'm not accepting it. Who wrote this? Who wrote this? Who wrote this? Show me the proof, case. That's what I'm here for. Who wrote this for you? Allow it. Allow it, man. This is, this is so much better than all of your fucking music. Yeah. Like, it's so obvious. Even yeah. the lyrics. This is not you. This is not you. Bro, I ain't even trying to be a hater, but this is... That's what I'm saying. I don't want to... That's, in my video, it's, it's weird, dog. I'm glad that I wasn't the only one. I was like, man, this just don't sound like him. They want to hate on the music, but I'm making hate. Is that designer? Does he know designer? I bet fuck it. I bet he fucking out. I bet he fucking help. There's no way. I don't know. I don't yeah. know. Someone's help. Nigga sleep on designer. This, right. this is actually just alright. I, like I can't. Like <laughs> <shit. laughs> <laughs> oh, you fucking prick. Yeah, he said this shit costs like a brick. <laughs> Nigga, how the fuck does Jake Paul know what a brick going for? That's what I'm saying. Like, he said it costs about a brick. What the fuck you know about that? Tan, nigga, what you know about that soft, that hard, nigga? What you, you ain't flooding the streets with no nickel bags, nigga. What? That's what I'm saying, like. <laughs> I didn't even peep that lyric the first time. <laughs> oh, costs like a brick. Oh, oh yeah, see, see, it tastes like on it too. Unreal! Wow! Wow! Well played, babe. You well played. You. <laughs> All right, now let's get to it. Hey, that was a hilarious geez. reaction. Yo, they're all doing it. Rice, Jake, nah, this is this is no way. Bro, I need to check this. Let's go. Gee, this is okay. crazy. Uh huh. Uh huh. Is the website down or something? Ray, that's finessed it. That's finessed it. Hey, what is this? What's going on? What's going on, man? All right, well, looks like the website's down. Wow. Damn. All right, well. Well, he, he Illuminati for real? I, I don't believe you wrote that. But, you know, if you did, uh, fair play, man. Out of all the tunes you ever made, that was the first one. I was like, yeah, this is all right. I mean, don't get me wrong. You're still a fucking douchebag.
I knew this motherfucker didn't write this. Okay, see, this is what this. Wait. Shit, bro. I knew this prick, this stupid fucking idiot, didn't write this song. Man thought he could get away with it, man. Um. Now, I could be wrong. Now, this is pretty damning. This is pretty damning. Designer and kill. Yeah, that's pretty, pretty damning. My only thing is, I'm pretty sure, didn't KSI. Um, on the rice gum video, use like that. I still feel like that other website is a bit more. Um, like I wanted to see what that says, but this is pretty damning. Cause at the end of the day, whoever wrote this stuff isn't Jake's team. Even if this is iTunes or Spotify, you don't upload music, and somebody else gets to. Uh, this was his team that did this. No, 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 no. So my watch, family. It makes sense. Designers in it. I mean, Jay, you don't have to write your music. You can do a rice gum. It's cool, but don't come at me saying I don't write my music because I write. Ah, uh, come on! You got designer to write. And the thing that killed me the most is if designer would have would have came out with this, niggas would not have. It would not have gotten as big. I hate that. I don't get it. Designer is literally. I don't understand why niggas sleep on the. Do you, and do you know that designer and panda said, uh, uh, pop a perk, I can stand up gorillas, they finna fill you with bananas, for feelings, I finna pull up in the phantom, the niggas that kill a nigga on the camera, be, uh, be rolling his dance bigger than the pentacle, ox for grimmin, but pull up your pants. He is a spitter too, that's why. Man. All of my songs, all of them, and you don't, so we These can't compare man. each other, on, okay? Man. We're on different realms, okay? I mean, it is what it is. Why would designer be on the writers? If he didn't write the song, that's like why true. isn't Jake Paul in the writing? That's true. That's <laughs> so, yeah, true. It's done. Hey, bro, you better pay them enough because you, <laughs> they are doing wonders for you <laughs> for those lyrics, bro. That, I don't want to have this keep going on. I want a twenty-minute video. It look like now, as weird as this sounds, is that's pretty damning. And I'm gonna go ahead and say my better judgment probably is saying that designer a hundred percent wrote that. And the more I listen to the lyrics, the more the, the lyric that sold it to me is cost like cost a brick. Nobody cost a brick, Jake? What a brick cost. Man, I wish I could have called that day. What a brick cost. Don't Google it. What a brick cost. What you mean cost like a brick, man? Ah! You out here in the band though, Jake? <laughs> he made he turned 36 to a baby, nigga. Yeah, okay. <laughs> hey man, this isn't looking good. Uh I feel a little bit lied to. It's still the best song Jay Paul has done to me. And um, KSI kind of shot holes through that one. So I'm waiting for the Jake response. KSI, man, I, I do want to see uh, uh, this on, on, on wax, though. Put it on wax. I'm here for it. We out.